Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. And for those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Rebecca Gardner. Like my sh like my scrunchie. <laughs> I actually made it myself out of a bandana. <laughs> um, but anyways, uh that's beside the point. Welcome back to my to another episode of my Read Along With Me series. Um, so for today's episode, we're going to be reading two chapters. Um, yesterday we read three chapters. And in these chapters, Melinda talks a little bit about Andy. And she calls him it. And she just has, she recalls some memories, some horrible memories with him. And she was talking about how he, he was her biggest night nightmare. And then uh, Melinda was setting up was setting up her, her closet, and the school board is still deciding the mascot. But for today's episode, it's not gonna be anything important. It's just about Melinda talking about. Her talking more about her Spanish teacher and about um, job day. So let's get right, let's get reading. My Spanish teacher breaks the no English rule to tell us what that we need, that we had better stop pretending we don't understand the homework assignments or we're all going to get detention. Then she repeats what she just said in Spanish, though it seems as if she tosses in a few extra phrases. I don't know why she hasn't figured it out yet. If she just taught us all the swearing words the first day, we would have Done, but done whatever she wanted the rest of the year. Detention does not sound appealing. I do my homework. I do my homework. Choose five verbs and conjugate them. To translate, traducer. I traducate. To flunk, fracasar. Yo, yo am almost fracas. Fr for cassari for cassaring <laughs> to hide esconder to escape escaper to forget alvider <laughs> um if i butcher these words wrong for all you spanish people people i am really sorry i don't um I don't really speak very well Spanish. All I know is the numbers. Um, but I don't read it, so... Yeah. Just in case we forget that, we are here to get a found- get a good foundation so we can go to college to- college live up our best- live up our potential, get a good- job live happily ever after and go and go to disney world we have a job day like all things high school it starts with a test a test of my desires and my dreams do i a prefer to spend time with a large group of people b prefer to spend time with a small group of uh close friends C. Prefer to stay to spend time with family. D. Or D. Spend time with spend time alone. Am I a a helper? B. A doer. C. A planner. Or D. A dreamer. If I were tied to railroad tracks and the free <laughs> and the three fifteen. Sorry, my mom was yelling. <laughs> And the three fifteen train to Rochester was was ready to put 
to cut a path across my my middle? Would I a scream for help? B ask my my friends to chew through the ropes? C remember that my favorite jeans were in the dryer and were hopelessly wrinkled? D close my eyes and pretend nothing was wrong. Two hundred questions later, I get my results. I should consider a career in A, forestry, B, firefighting, C, communications, or D, mortuary, uh, mortuary science. Heather's results are clearer. She should be a nurse. It makes her jump up and down. This is the best. I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'll be a candy stripper at at the at the hospital this year. Why don't you do it with me? I'll study hard in biology and go to SU and get my RN. What a great plan. How could she know this? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing in the next five minutes and she has the next ten years figured out. I'll worry about making it out of making it making it out of ninth grade alive then i'll think about a career path um yeah so basically um uh if i could recall from the chapters um Melinda talks about her Spanish teacher, and her Spanish teacher was getting real frustrated because the students pretend that they don't understand uh, the the assignments, and and she has had it like she was like, stop doing this or or. Or one of you is getting detention. <laughs> but. Yeah. <laughs> and then there's. Um, um, career day where. Um, everybody just answer. The questions to the their, um, survey thing, I guess, and they just figure out what they're gonna do in the future, so, um, yeah, so my discussion question of the day is, um, what is your career day, what is your career day at school like? And, um, also, what are you planning on doing in the future? Um, what are you planning on doing in the, in your career? Let me know in the comment, in the comments below. And let's get the discussion going, you guys. That's why I started this series, so that I can interact with you guys and connect. And, um, and... Just discuss things about the book because this book is honestly amazing. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I hope you guys liked this series and I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And um, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you guys would get notified when new episodes are coming. And... Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to stay happy, stay safe, and stay cool. And I'm off to the moon, and I will be back soon.